Welcome to Data Embassy. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a Pi to Sunburst drill down on set action. So this is a Pi with uh, three categories. If we click one of them, we will see the subcategories, which looks like a Sunburst chart. I'm not going to uh, delete this. Okay. And uh, so this is a chart that's hidden. Uh, you can see uh, we have uh, some field here. But I'm going to delete this as well. Uh, and uh, this is the last one. I can only clear it. You to delete this as well. So the first thing we need to do is create a set category set and leave the selection blank. Next, we need to create a calculated field. We call it conditional subcategory. So if category set, then show subcategory. So the first chart we are going to create is a pie chart uh, with uh, category uh, and the uh, quantity as the angle. The second is still a pie chart, but this time it has two dimensions uh, in the color shelf. Okay, we just showed you how to put two dimensions into the same color shelf. Pie chart and the, the quantity is the angle. Make it big. Okay, the other one. Also, we want to make it big. Okay, the second one here. Uh, we need to make the color white so that it will hide itself. It only appear conditionally. Okay, double click here and double click again. Uh, select white. Double click white, double click white. So we don't really, we don't really see it, but it is there. And uh, we need to make the size bigger than the previous one. So this step is we need to create a dashboard and put the uh, both sheet on the canvas, but one on top of the other. So we need to put sheet two at the bottom, hide the, the title and the pie is there. And we want to make it the 600 by 600. Okay. And this one, note that uh, uh, the sheet I put on it uh, in floating mode, okay, so that we can position them uh, easily. The same, zero, zero, 600, 600. And we need to uh, format the background to be transparent. Uh, instead of white, okay. because we want to show the sub categories when necessary. The last step is to set up the the action. Okay, this the action will be driven by select, and uh, the source sheet is uh, sheet one. Okay, and so. 
we want to remove all values from set when we clear the selection. Okay, okay. Let's click. Voila! Uh, we see uh, the subcategory appear. So that's about it. Uh, we are not going to add the labels. Uh, and we believe uh, you can do it. Uh, it should be easy. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you have uh, questions or if you like us to talk about a particular topic, please leave a message in the comment area. Uh, please also click like or subscribe uh, if you enjoy watching the video. Your encouragement will help us make more Tableau videos like this. See you, see you next time.